Today, Kevin is going to do a blind taste test between, we have the regular Klondike Crunch. And then no sugar added. These were $4.12 each at Publix. So it didn't matter whether you bought the regular or the no sugar, you're gonna pay $4.12 for them. And the Crunch, I don't even know if we've ever had this one before. Mm. If we have, I definitely haven't had the no sugar. Uh, we have done a, I think a blind taste test a couple years back of the regular Klondike bar versus the no sugar added, but it was just the regular, not the crunch. So the crunch says it is frozen vanilla dairy dessert bar with chocolatey coating and crispy rice pieces. So this is like a Nestle crunch bar yeah. or something. Yeah. Okay. So let's compare the numbers on this. This is no sugar added light ice cream and milk chocolate. Yeah. Okay. So the ice cream itself. And is this good. is, so yours says it's ice cream? Yeah, does it? Yes, okay, so that's a difference. Kevin's no sugar added is actually ice cream. Mine is not. Mine is a frozen dairy dessert. Interesting. Yes, so there's your difference right there. So you, at least you're getting the real yeah, deal well, if you get well, that. How, how big are yours? Mine are, uh, it says uh, they're 4.5 ounces each. Yeah, four, yeah mine yeah. are four ounces Four each. ounces each. Okay, so let's look on the back. It says uh, one bar, 82 grams. 74 grams. So these are a little So you get lighter. less. Okay, so these are 250 calories. 160. 160, so but it's it, almost 100 calories less. But it is going to be a little, a little less a little because less. it's a little lighter too. This has 14 grams of total fat. Wow, mine has nine. This has less than five milligrams of cholesterol. Yeah, same. Uh, this has 65 milligrams of sodium. Same. 28 carbs. 23, so it's pretty close. To okay, that. 19 grams of total sugars. Mine has six. Wow, that's a huge difference. Mm -hmm. But I mean, that's the point of that. And this has two grams of protein. Two, three grams of protein. Three grams of protein. How much sugar alcohol do you use though? Does it say sugar alcohol? Mine has 11 grams of sugar alcohol. No, mine says diet. You don't have it. Mine says total sugar and 14 grams yeah, of you, added mine sugar. Mine has actual sugar alcohol. No. And whereas that one doesn't. So. These are made by Unilever. Uh, Klondikebar.com. Okay, so we've compared them. So we sh uh, let's open these up. Okay. And these are nice that they're in a box because you can keep them in your freezer real easy in the box. I wonder okay. if this is going to be thinner. Oh. No. no not really. I think it'll be about the same. Okay. No, I'll be able to tell. <laughs> so yeah, he won't be able to tell blindfolded. Not with these. Sometimes we can't do it. If, if we can't do one, we don't do a blind taste test. And sometimes you can't because something's shaped different or it is noticeably bigger or whatever. These should be about the same. Okay. This Even, is supposed to be a crunch. There's not a lot of crunch on that one. Oh wow. There's not. Well, this is supposed to be a crunch. Yeah, you're not getting much either. Not a lot of crunch on this either. I mean, seriously? Maybe it's once you dig into it. Okay, go ahead and put your... Um, My mask on. Put your mask on. And I'm. Uh, he does not know which one he's going to get first. Nope. And so I will... Um, I think you probably break them in half. I will hold up... Uh, well, you know what? I'm not going to put it on this plate yet. I'm going to take them off the plate because... I don't want to get them mixed up, so they're coming off that plate. Okay, so I'm gonna mix these up. How can we know kind of clue which one you have? Okay, so um, this is the one that he's gonna have first. Okay. Did you break it or? Yeah, I broke it. There we go. It's like half of it. Nice snappy chocolate. Tell you what, you don't get hardly any crunch in there though. That was a lie, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, I want it covered. 
I bet you the picture on the front is ridiculously comically different. Yeah, it's comically different, all right. Here's the next one. Is it up and down? Uh, yeah. <laughs> There's definitely a difference. Don't let, give little Jimmy this unless you want a mess because that, that chocolate is so thin that once you take a bite, he goes everywhere. All right. Okay, hold on. One more second, please. <laughs> That's what you're laying down somewhere. Oh, okay. Um, okay, was this the second one I gave you? That's the second one. Okay. Okay. What do you think? <laughs> you, you can open your eyes. I can't take my blindfold off. I have no idea what's on my hands. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would have grabbed with my fingers. Okay. Um, well, I've been licking and sticking it in my mouth. And, yeah. Yeah. Um, they, they definitely taste different. Mm -hmm. The second one, and I don't know which one it was, but it doesn't have near the flavor. Mm -hmm. um, Sweetness-wise, they're okay. Both of them are okay sweetness-wise. But the first one seemed to be like more of a uh, more flavorful. Just had, it had more of a vanilla flavor in the ice cream itself. Whereas the second one just didn't have as much flavor. It, for, so for me, it wasn't about sweetness. It's about flavor. Um, the chocolate seemed to be the same for both of them. Okay. I want you to try the chocolate from this one. It doesn't matter if your hands are dirty. Your hands are already dirty. I want you to try the chocolate on this one. Because you still don't know which is which. Mm -hmm. I don't know which one's which what right now. You, uh, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> you have no idea which is which. Get yeah, a good chocolate. Bro. I know, but I want you to try it anyway. I want to, I want to know if you tell the difference between the chocolate. And now I want you to try this chocolate. Hold on. These always were messy as can be. The first one's a little bit um, stronger chocolate flavor. I think so too. The second one's not quite as good chocolate wise. I think so too. Um, so they probably made adjustments in their in their chocolate. I think so too. So, do you have any idea which is the where? first one is the best one of the two? Okay, that is the full sugar. Okay, that's the regular. But it's not like I said. It's not because of sweetness. I didn't mind the sweetness of the second one. The second one was sweetness wise. It was fine. Uh -huh. It just didn't have any of that vanilla flavor really going for it. It just really didn't have much flavor. Right. I, I agree. So even though the first one, the regular one, is frozen dairy dessert. I have actually tried the vanilla part of each one of them by themselves, mm -hmm. and it does have more flavor. Oh, yeah. Period. It even seems creamier and everything. It seems more like an ice cream. Yeah. It, the, 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 uh, the, the light ice cream, just it's just lacking flavor. So mm -hmm. it's like, yes, it's, fr it's something frozen, and it's something cold. Yeah. But it's not, it has no flavor. It's no. like they sucked all the flavor out of it. I mean, if you weren't trying them side by side and you needed no sugar, you'd be fine with it. I think you would be fine. But yeah. but if you're comparing them side by side, it's like, why in the world would you ever buy that? You wouldn't buy it unless you needed no sugar. I don't almost. think you would either. Because they're think, the same price. So yeah, they're, yeah, they're the same price unless you're... Watching not, calories or something too. Yeah, if you're watching calories or if you're diabetic or something like that, I think those people would buy the no sugar at it. And for those people, I really don't think you're... 
it, because you're not going to be trying them side by side, mm -hmm. I think you're going to be perfectly content with it. Yeah. yeah, it's fun. But it absolutely does not have the flavor mm -hmm. that the, the regular one No, does. it's amazing the difference in flavor. Mm -hmm. And even just the, the creaminess of the ice cream itself, that, or the non-dairy dessert. Um, it, it, the non-dairy dessert is actually seems creamier. Yeah, it, so it does. And because so. for me, I um, I've said this before. If I'm going to treat myself, I'm not going to treat myself to a, a, a frozen dairy dessert. Um, I'm going to treat myself to real ice cream. Right. Um, so. So in this case. In this case, I think the frozen dairy dessert tastes is better mm -hmm. uh but i'm i'm still not a klondike uh You're customer okay. anyway there's uh, a lot of calories in a very small package yes so. and i feel like i always feel like i have to because i'm holding it i have to eat it quickly because yeah, it's melting even if i were to put <laughs> it in a bowl i would still feel like i had to eat it quickly mm -hmm. And uh, so if I'm not a, the regular Klondike customer anyway, right. so whether it's frozen dairy dessert or not, it doesn't matter to me because I'm not buying it. But I'm, I'm going to comment on the crunch part. Oh, it's that's ridiculous. Cool. That is totally. Because the pictures, don't they show it like really well? I mean, yes. it's like coated with it. it. Is, yeah, it's all yes. over the thing. That is a complete. Well, let's open two more because I'm going to have to take a picture anyway. Okay, so this is the regular. This is no sugar. Um, it's total BS. They're like I said, it's comical. total. It's a complete and utter lie. That crunch part. <laughs> yeah. I think you could literally count. People are suing Reese's because the they Reese's doesn't eyeballs. look like the package. Okay, why has no one sued Unilever? Now this one has a has few. More, it has more, but it still isn't like the package. <laughs> that package hasn't like coded. Why like. has no one sued? These companies need to answer. Answer. They need to be honest. I mean, uh, it's just absolutely ridiculous. I'll keep it. I'll take one together and separate. Yeah, but. that one looks better. But it looks it's better, near the picture but it the still package. doesn't look like the picture on the front. Uh -huh. And so, what are those little um, little Debbie makes those little chocolate things that are covered with um, with the little rice cereal? I don't know what they're called, like star. Oh, or they're like star crunch. Yeah, star, star crunch. Yeah, that's what that picture looks like yes. on the Klondike. Is like a star crunch, yeah. absolutely coated and with. This is what and then you look did. at it, and it's like. Yeah. Who was drunk that day? Exactly. Well, I think... <laughs> Who was running that machine? They're just lying. Because if you're buying that for the crunch, you ain't getting the crunch. No. That's for sure. No. You, I, when I've I been... I mean, you might as well just buy the chocolate. That's what I was thinking. When I've been into that first one, I thought, I may as well be have bought a regular yeah. corn diet because you there's no difference in yeah. those. Yeah, if there are a difference in calories, it's probably lower calorie one of the two. Yeah. you're not getting anything. Yeah, I think that these are a joke. I, I would never buy these again, personally. But, you know, that's it's been a fun review. Yeah, oh yeah. And they're good. I like the, I like the flavor of them. I've always liked corn diet bars, but they're, they're just, I eat them too fast for me to justify them having them for a snack so yeah yeah it's just nothing that that's a meat problem <laughs> yeah exactly but i hope you enjoyed the video hopefully this was informative a little bit uh but we did we also bought more klondike bars to just try just to just try it won't be a blind taste test but we tried like four uh we bought like four more flavors to review so there will be another video and there's lots of klondike reviews already on the channel if you mm -hmm. type in tammy dunn klondike those will come up for yeah, you. And I'll so. bring a paper towel next time. Yeah, well. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.